It's just over a week to VE Day and the celebrations to mark the 50th anniversary of the end of the war. Today, some of those memories were relived in Suffolk, with the start of a three-day pageant to show what life was really like back in 1945. Cantwell Hall in Suffolk, almost 50 years after VE Day, and suddenly the clock turns back to April the 28th, 1945. Everyone entering needs a security pass. Big trouble if you haven't got one. What about now? What are you doing with that camera? This is a restricted area. If you ever got a permit for it, you can't use it. Switch it off, as I'll call out the guard. Thankfully, we escaped, and along with hundreds of school children from all over the region, managed to sneak in to find out what life was like as the war drew to a close. Everything's been recreated with volunteers taking the part of telephone operators, nurses and even wounded servicemen. From the relaxed atmosphere of the officers' mess right down to the cook below stairs trying to do her best with the available rations. Everything's there. Well, I'm making a, a steamed fish roll for Mrs. Starkey Benson and her family. Here's the recipe here. And it's, uh, it's quite a nice recipe. And then they're having the last of the bottled tomatoes and potatoes and cabbage and then for after so they're having a nice chocolate pudding but we're a bit short on the sugar so i'm putting grated carrot in the in the pudding to make it nice and sweet it was outside that the youngsters got the chance to get the feel for things as they really were tanks were on maneuver soldiers were showing off their shooting skills even prisoners of war were being grilled oh. Many of the children and their teachers had entered into the spirit of things, dressing in the period costume. I'll tell you what might be useful, some petrol coupons. Yeah, or diesel, I can do diesel as well, you know. You name your price, I've got them all in here, whatever you want. It's really good. It's amazing how they put it together. I don't like wearing the heels. I think I should have come dressed as a Land Army girl. <laughs> it's hard. Did you manage to find any stockings there? That would be telly. <laughs> Does it smell a bit? Like anything. As the country gets geared up for the VE Day celebrations, organisers of 1945 relived, are hoping that as well as having some fun, the younger generations who go will realise that the war must never be forgotten. David Golly and plenty of others reliving 1945.